our comedian Solives by Ashwarya, Angela and Katie. This is our video on how to make the truncated icosahedron. We are using fizz units invented by Tom Hull to make an origami structure of the truncated icosahedron. This is how you make one fizz unit. Now you have to make 90 more. Why? Because each fizz unit gives you one edge on your solid and there are 90 edges in the truncated icosahedron. So let's get cracking. Join three units together to make a vertex as shown. You keep adding these fizz units until you end up with your completed truncated icosahedron. Now you have your pentagon base. When you join your units together, make sure that each pentagon face is surrounded by hexagon faces and each hexagon has a hexagon and a pentagon alternating around it. The truncated icosahedron has 20 hexagon faces and 12 pentagon faces. It has 90 edges and 60 vertices. It is derived from the icosahedron, a platonic solid with 20 triangle faces. So how do you derive it? While truncation is the process of cutting off the corners in such a way that you form two new regular shapes, the triangle faces form hexagons because for each corner you cut off you add a new side. The faces made from the corners are pentagons because there are five faces meeting at the vertex. How many faces are there? The 20 triangle faces form hexagons and the 12 vertices form pentagons, so there will be a total of 32 faces on the solid. How many edges are there? There are 20 hexagon faces and 12 pentagon faces, so that gives us a total of 180 edges. But each edge is shared, so each edge is counted twice. Therefore, we have to divide the number of edges by 2, and that gives us 90 edges. And the vertices? Well, there are 12 vertices in the icosahedron, so when we truncate it, one vertex gives you 5 vertices, so that gives you 60 vertices. Your solid has 32 faces, 60 vertices and 90 edges. And that is how your truncated icosahedron is derived. It follows Euler's characteristic, that is V minus E plus F equals 2. To substitute, 60 minus 90 plus 32 is equal to 2. Thank you for watching.